channel firewall again today we are going to discuss uh, command line for secure excel i'll be getting a lot of comments like uh, how secure excel works uh, what is their uh, accept and drop templates uh, what is differences between them so i have decided let's talk on a video and let's see uh, how the secure excel works uh, first i would like to show you uh, how you can see the secure excel you are, when you log into your gateway go to the expert mode and from here type the command fw excel statistics and you will be seeing what is you have for the secure excel its status and everything so here you are seeing uh, the few terms like uh, SND, their status, which interfaces it covered, uh, what feature it gives. Uh, I have a two, you know, high intensive, you know, knowledgeable videos on Secure Excel. How these terms, you know, uh, comes together, what these terms call, and how they work together, and uh, how the Secure Excel works. If you haven't watched my video, uh, I'll be putting the link in the description. So go ahead and watch the Secure Excel uh, video. Uh, for now, uh, let's understand what is this command, what is this, uh, you know, uh, options, accept template, drop template, NAT template, what it is, and why they are enabled, why they are disabled, what is their purpose, and everything. Oh, uh, right now, uh, 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 I have R80.30 Gaia OS uh, uh, with the uh, open server configuration. So uh, guys, uh, if you want to learn more on a secure Excel, I'll just highlight you one uh, SK here, SK98722. Just refer this SK and uh, look into uh, more how you can, you know, uh, learn through this SK. In this SK, uh, there are uh, all these definition and terms got explained. So let's concentrate on uh, specific details. Uh, like uh, first one, what are these templates are? Okay, accept, drop, and NAT template. So when you come here on this SK, it's explained these terms very well. So first thing is your accept template. So this is a feature that accelerates the speed at which a connection is established by matching a new connection to set of attributes. When a new connection matches accept template, subsequent connects, connections are established without performing a rule match and therefore are accelerated. Right. What this means? So you know guys, when uh, we talk about the stateful packet inspection, at that time what happens? There are the parameters like source IP, destination IP, source port, destination ports and protocols and sequence numbers. Everything get captured in your firewall state table. We call it kernel table. And once that got captured, whatever the subsequent packets, you know, who come again and matches those attributes, that packet is get accepted without, you know, going further to see the rules and, you know, match the rules and everything. In a similar way, in a secure Excel, they have a similar functionality. So I have explained this in detail in my secure Excel videos, the link in the description, but I'll give you an overview now. So what accept template does, it captures all these details, okay, and store into their, uh, uh, we call it like a kernel table or a connection table once that is stored based on this connection parameters it will forward the packet without you know checking the rule match and everything so accept templates are generated from active connection according to the policy rules currently accept templates acceleration is performed only on the connection with the same destination port using wildcard for source port so only the difference uh, with the stateful inspection and the uh, secure excel inspection here the source port which usually you know uh, uh, stateful packet inspection capture which is whatever that coming towards the firewall is as it is but with this secure excel 
the source port entity is convert into the wildcard what do you mean by wildcard the source port converted like a star so whatever uh, we give it as a source uh, like uh, whatever the things come as a source the firewall sees at any so wildcard is nothing but the any entry so what source port firewall consider any and the destination port usually it checks so likewise the packets entities their attributes store into the their connection table note size of the secure excel connection table template table is limited size okay so this is what the the things you can look at what size uh, uh, the secure excel have it's saying it's limited to one fourth of the size of the firewall connection table so firewall connection table is used in your stateful packet inspection whereas secure excel connection table use for secure excel packet captures so that is the guys exact difference so some of you most of you guys are asking me what is difference between this you know accept temp uh, template and what is there in accept template what is there in a stateful packet inspection what is the exact comparison parameters so two different tables keep in mind one is your firewall connection table which is used in stateful packet inspection whereas it has a you know use size as compared to the secure excel connection table so two different tables got created due to that the processing of the packet get increased or enhanced right i hope you got my point what is the accept template and then there is a drop template feature that accelerate the speed at which a connection is dropped by matching a new connection to a set of attributes when a new connection matches the drop template subsequent connection are dropped without performing the rule match and therefore are accelerated Currently, drop template acceleration is performed only on connection with the same destination port. Drop templates are generated from the policy rule by specific, uh, I mean by a special algorithm. And what else they have here? Let me scroll it a bit. So, analyze the rule policy, uh, analyze the rule base produce mutual let me clear up the screen produce mutually exclusive range offload the range of secure excel once a packet is dropped offload a drop template all subsequent packets are matching that range will be dropped by the secure excel so what is drop template so drop template is something where you know if there is something happen on your environment and you are facing the you know you know bandwidth choke attacks like ddos attacks or you know uh, uh, some sort of attacks where your bandwidth is getting choked and you are getting always the same request from you know some unknown sources in such scenarios if you uh, haven't enabled this drop template what will happen whatever the packet will come to your firewall they process with all the stages of the uh, firewall inspection so uh, drop template is not enabled whichever the new packet comes hit to the firewall it will check okay the source destination and everything because every time the packet is coming out of from some different sources so all you know basic checking will happen but if in case you have enabled the drop template and if the packet is coming out of the different sources however the packet subsequent packets which is coming out of the different sources or from the same sources those will you know get denied or dropped by default if they are not legitimate so there is no way we can stop the packet coming out of some different sources but if the packet which is hitting you know from uh, your bots and you know always coming from uh, same sources that time this drop template will help you to you know just discard those packets and you know get the firewall memory space and buffer free that is what the use of the drop template if you see uh, here 
the drop template option we usually put it disabled but if you got in scenarios where we have facing you know uh, issues or we are you know facing the bandwidth choke attacks and we are getting you know uh, packets hitting from the different sources from the same sources at the same time if you wanted to uh, you know get rid of that situation you have to enable drop template so somehow your you know processing of the firewall will get increasing by you know dropping all those details i mean all those packets i hope you got my point for the drop template as well now there is something called a nat uh let me look if they haven't give any details for a nat template here if not i'll i'll explain you okay so i don't see uh, any uh, details here for the nat template but nat template is also gives you you know flexibility to speed of your processing how you define a lot of you know nat statement in your firewall uh, different nat conversions for the uh, source uh, natting and the destination natting what you have done with your firewalls in that situation if the nat template is enabled it will process your packet faster way like the way uh, we do in a you know uh, acceleration for whatever the new packet comes the details entities get captured likewise in the nat template all this uh, you know uh, natting part i mean the mapping part get captured once and subsequent packet based on that natting uh, uh, mappings those get accepted so it's that simple it just you know accelerate your speed right so this is uh, basic things i have explained all these details in uh, my uh, secure excel uh, videos so go ahead and watch uh, now let's just concentrate on the commands what we get with the secure excel so this is what uh, how you can you know run fw excel stat and read all these details right uh, if you want to make this on off it's a simple command which you can run if you want to say make this secure excel on or off let's say like fw excel and if you say on oh my mistake FWXL on so if you see fw statistics fw sorry excel stack you will see the status is enabled on it was on earlier so that's why but if you make it off and if you run the same command here you will see the status is got disabled your acceleration is got disabled so most of the time when you do the troubleshooting when you run the ability monitor command uh, if you have a secure excel enabled you will get you know a little bit you know a fuzzy output where uh, whatever those things are uh, coming because the packet is get accelerated so you, all the packages is not get captured as it is so usually when we run the ability monitor we make the secure excel off and then we'll capture the packets let me make it on right and if you like to see what are the commands available for fw excel you just have to run fw excel without any parameters it will give you different things right so let's run for example run this uh, template things let's see what we can templates signature the template table is empty right now we are not having any connections so it's give me that the template table is empty likewise if you run for the connection table okay what is the command for it yes it's also empty because we are not we don't have more connections uh, as of now right 
let's run one more command here let's say dos blacklist interface to the ip so you can you know say interface to dos mitigation technique you can secure excel commands so let's see if i can run stack like that yeah so if you have enabled drop template and you are you wanted to see what are the things i'll get dropped and everything uh, you have to just explore these options what we have here right so guys this is it for this video if you like my video please subscribe my channel and press bell icon so whatever the latest upload video or videos will come to you as soon as i'll upload them thanks for watching this video and have a wonderful day bye bye